What's up, my seven fans? My name is Jamie Kiwi Bo, and um, I uploaded this video earlier explaining that I couldn't do any doll reviews, but I feel a tiny little bit better. Um, I've eaten something, I've had a drink, you know, something like that, and I do feel a little better. I do, I do still have a sore throat and sniffles, but I do feel a lot better. Um, I'm not gonna do a doll review because I have nothing planned, but um, what I will do is I will, I will show you something now. Over over the time that I haven't been collecting all these lovely little dolls, also I've got some these things obviously you know called pets, which are obviously the Monster High version, the Monster High little pet things that obviously comes with them. Um, I have a few because um I've started to find them really adorably cute. So I have got some here with me. Um, I don't know where all of them belong to. I don't know who all of them belong to. So bear with me if you do know which what each one belongs to. If I don't mention the names, comment down below with the names and depending on which pair it is, do let me know because I have probably no clue where half of these came from because my mom bought me a set which came with most a little bit most of the pets, but I do know most of them. Half of them I don't know. Half of them I do know where they came from. Most, but maybe two of them don't come from Monster High. Two of them actually come from, I think, Brad's, I think it was. I'm not too sure. But, either way, I will show you all of them. Now, and, um, yes, I did change my hair colour very recently. Um, it does look a little better now than it did before because I have kind of coloured it. Well, I've conditioned it so it does feel a lot better. Um, but it didn't feel a lot better earlier. Um, I think a little bit of the bleach get went on the brush and it just kind of like stuck in, so I just needed to wash it, clean it out, and all that goody stuff like that to make it nicer. Um, let's go on with the video. Um, first little thing, first little pet I have is this little scorpion here. Now, it is adorably cute. If you can see slightly there, he does have a little smile. There's a little scorpion here. Um, this one I don't know where, who it belongs to. So, first little pet, little scorpion. Um, I know exactly where this one came from. This is Venus's flytrap. Venus's, Venus flytrap's pet, which, the Venus flytrap. And, um, I, I like this one. This one's probably going to be my favourite. Not because it's bright green and, it, and it, it's in a pot and I like plants. It's because it has the most cheesiest smile of all. You can't actually see the little kind of gradient of teeth, but that's something I might do as a little kind of little project. Is kind of make those teeth kind of go stand out. So it's like that's Venus's um, little pet. This one is this one was actually I think was the first. No, it's kind of the second one I got. This one came with the set that my mum bought me. This is um, Rebecca Steam's penguin. And again, I might do some little kind of painting to kind of try and bring everything out. But this is Venus's Flytrap's Penguin. And I love it. Um, this is another one I don't know where it came from. But this is a little purple elephant. I know it's Monster High because obviously it matches everything else. And it's the same kind of quality plastic. Um, but I think this is Abby Abominals. I think I've got to make sure of that one. Um... So, I think this is Abby's because it's kind of like a um, snowy type thing. It's purple. I'm not too sure, but. Um, da -da 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 -da. This actually came from the Circus Defeat. This is Claudine Ringmaster. Um, little kind of cat lion thing. Which actually should go through here. Yeah. Go through the hoop here, and she should be holding it. But obviously, there's there's no there's no way she's gonna fit through there and stay and whatnot. And Claudine has this little problem. This one there has this little problem with holding things. So this is Claudine Circus to Freak, the little tiger. There's another one that came with Circus to Freak. This is um Twyla. This one. Twyla is a little kind of it's like a um the clapping penguin. Penguin. <laughs> Clapping monkey, but this is a bunny rabbit, and as much as it does look a little bit odd, 
I like it. I like it when things are a little bit odd. Again, this camera isn't doing this justice at all. So I might post pictures on my Facebook page, which is down below. Um, also, you might have seen if you do look at the descriptions that I have added channels down to that. I will explain it at the end of the video. But this is Twyla's little bunny. This one I actually really don't know. It's a little pink hedgehog. This is also from Monster High. Again, same plastic, same quality. Um, but this is a little kind of tiny little hedgehog, and I love it. I don't know where it's from. Don't know who it's from. I think this one comes from Spectra. It is missing a tail. To bear with me. Uh, this is what looks like a ferret. Because of the long spindly body. But I think this is Spectra's. I think. Again, don't quote me on these. Um, this, is, this isn't a pet as such. But I like to think it is. This is a... This is um, Jane Boo Little's sloth backpack and again you can see it's a backpack because it has this opening here and it's quite hollow um, but this is Jane Boodle's backpack because I did get the doll brand new um, as you can see I don't have a Jane Boo I, I have the head of the body but they are two separate things because the body is actually on Twyla um, again I'll explain that over the door overview soon but and then I got these two here which is, they're both, I think, yeah, they are both Draculaurus. This is, I think this is the dead tired version, I think, because of the um, little bow and the um, bathrobe thing. But this is just adorable, come on. Can't say no to that face. And this one, this one's actually missing a, um, it's um signature bow. Which is obviously, as you know, um, the bow that is the logo of Monster High. But this is another pet, which is a sketch, and again, it is kind of odd. But I thought this was would have been for um, um, Skeletor, but it's not. It's actually Draculaurus. I think it's Draculaurus. Again, don't quote me on this. Um, the other two pets I have are not from the Monster High series, but they're still adorable. Anyway, um, I think these are from the Brat series. Um, this is a little, kind of little tiny piggy. This is the ones that feel very furry. Um, this is a little um, piggy. I think they're from Bratz. Again, don't cut me on these. But little kind of bunny. Little bunny? Little um, piggy. I've named him Wildcat. Um, if you do, what, ooh, if you watch Vanos Gaming, you would have probably heard about a um, YouTuber called I Am Wildcat. And he's probably one of the funniest. Not one of the funniest, because I like a couple of them, but. I think he's probably one of like the ones that do, do a lot of humour when it comes to swearing. So, and then this is another bunny. Again, I can see that it's not from the monster high because if we can see the bunnies are completely different. But that's all the pets that I have. I will be getting more pets and I will be making one of those, these short little, I would say short, take minutes. <laughs> I will be making some of these, um, the little pet kind of videos I'll update you on the pets I get and whatnot too because I am collecting the pets as well as well as the dolls so hope you enjoy that in regarding to, to, the, to the video links below I have I I have made some friends that I count as really good friends and also, they are YouTubers themselves. They don't they don't particularly do what I do, but they they are very good friends of mine. And I just wanted to kind of get them noticed, even though I already have 16 subscribers. It's fine. You two, are, you guys are awesome. So I have Kucha Hira, which is my other half. He does. Painting tutorials. He also does reviews as well. He does some unboxings every so often. He also does challenges uh, Sometimes sometimes as well So go check up his channel. Give him some love for me um, Enic beer 40k. I have shouted him out before I might do actually like a weekly shout out So if you guys do want a shout out comment down below and I'll give you a shout out um, with the people I am naming you guys are default you guys are all default um, 
uh, links there, so you all, all you guys will always be there. Um, so it could be a 40k. Go check out his channel. I don't know specifically what he does because I've been catching up with another YouTuber's um, yet yeah, let's plays, and I'll tell you about that when I get to them. Um, Frost and Fist, um, Methos and Freak. Um, those two are probably one of the funniest pairs I have ever watched. And go give them some love because they they surely do deserve it as well as Kuja Hira and Inic Beer. They all deserve the love because they are just brilliant people. Um, tattoo for you. Um, this guy is such an inspiration. His name's Richard. This guy is such an inspiration. He does push ups on live streams on Facebook. He is so inspirational and you need to you need to give this guy some serious love down there. <laughs> You need to give him some love from the Dolly community, because he does reviews, I think he does painting tutorials, he does unboxings, and he also does his little thing, I think it was, um, something Wednesday, I've got to double check on that one. Now the last person is the one I've been catching up on YouTube videos on, because good god, <laughs> um, Dark Light Dreamer. Now he has, he's been doing some... Serious Outlaw set Let's Plays, and they are very brilliant for somebody that doesn't like horror. Yeah, I have dolls hanging from my ceiling in my living slash bedroom. But as someone who's not a fan of horror or jump scares, this person does the job. He is amazing. He is cool. He is fun, and he does great Let's Plays. So give him some dolly love down there, down there as well. Give all of the people I've mentioned. Uh, Kuja Hyra, Ikbir, Frost and Fierce, Tattoo For You, and Dark Light Dreamer. Give them some love from the Dolly community. And I'll see you in the next Dolly video. Stay plastic.